Hello all you classy people out there. So in this video, we are going to talk about three effective and very easy ways in which you can keep toxic people out of your life. Point number one and the simplest thing that you can do is be busy. When you are busy working on yourself, being productive yourself, enjoying your hobbies, enjoying time with your friends, doing things that interest you, and just building your own little palace, you don't have time to deal with toxic people. And when you turn the focus back onto yourself, you push all the toxic energies far away from you. So that is point number one, be busy. <laughs> point number two, do not be toxic yourself. Now I know this sounds harsh, but hear me out here. The truth is that like-minded people attract each each other if you notice a pattern that every now and then you just keep attracting toxic people then maybe it's time to do a little self-evaluation just look into yourself and try to understand objectively what is it within yourself that you keep on attracting these toxic energies into your life there is no harm and just because you sometimes show toxic behaviors does not make you a toxic person this is for everybody a person can be very toxic to you but they might be amazing sweet healthy individuals to somebody else so this is not to say that oh you're a toxic person person this is just saying that everybody can sometimes demonstrate toxic behavior so if you keep on attracting this kind of behavior then maybe there is something in you that is causing it that is creating it so it is time for some self-evaluation, get a notebook, put down your negative traits, and just try to figure it out. What is it? What is it that I can work on? It's just never too late to work on yourself. So that is point number two. Do not be toxic yourself. And the last one is distance yourself from toxic people so if you have done self-evaluation and you still feel that there are toxic people in your life physically actually create a distance between you and the person who is causing you despair or the person who is not uplifting you sometimes it's just easier said than done sometimes this person could be someone that you care about a family member or a friend that you really care about and their behaviors can be toxic and in those situations, I wouldn't say that you need to cut your ties from that person, but create a distance. It's not being selfish. Self-love comes first. You know how they say in times of emergencies on the plane, first you put your own mask and then you help your kids put their mask because you're not able to breathe properly yourself and you're gasping for air on the plane. You are not going to be able to function properly to help anybody else. That's how it is over here if you are not taking care of yourself you will not be able to take care of anybody else so self-love comes first i have my website cleverandclassy.com in the description section this video for more tips about peace of mind and stress relief activities that you can do and also some skincare if you're into that so that's it for my video i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe and share it with your friends i would love that thank you so much and i'll see you guys in my next one bye